Welcome to Things You Should Know, Civil War Edition. Today we're going to talk about the Battle of Simmons Bluff, located in Charleston County, South Carolina, on June 21st, 1862. Union Navy Lieutenant A.C. Rind was ordered to cut off the Charleston and Savannah Railroad. He would utilize the 55th Pennsylvania Infantry along with his gunboat, the Crusader, and a ship transport plantar. His target was near Simmons Bluff. It should be noted that one of our very own People You Should Know subjects, Robert Smalls, was piloting those ships. Isn't it amazing when our Things You Should Know series intertwine like this? Ryan's ships went up the Wadmala River south of Charleston. When they reached Wadmala Sound, Ryan had a detachment of infantry disembark. The infantry traveled up to Simmons Bluff and surprised Confederate Colonel Jay McCullough's 16th South Carolina Infantry. Due to the surprise by the Union troops, the Confederates immediately scattered into the surrounding terrain. The Union troops utilized this and raided and burned the Confederate camp and then returned to their ships. They then abandoned their initial goal of raiding the railroad and continued just raid further up the Confederate positions. This would be the first time a raid like this would happen. However, with this success, it would spark many raids in the future up and down the South Carolina coastline during the war. There are no recorded number of casualties for either side for this battle. Please join us again next time on Things You Should Know, Civil War Edition.